I'm David Curiel. I direct the Biologic Therapeutic Center here at Washington University. The focus of my lab is developing gene transfer vectors to facilitate gene therapy. The fundamental need in gene therapy is a pharmacologic one. You need to deliver genes to the correct cell. They need to be expressed at the correct level, and that needs to be accomplished with a high margin of safety. And right now, there's a lack of vectors that can accomplish that. So what we've done is we've taken a very useful vector. It's called adenovirus. It's the vector that has been used in the most human trials. But it lacked one key capacity, that is to achieve long-term gene expression. So you couldn't use it for correcting inherited genetic disorders like hemophilia or cystic fibrosis. And what we've done is we've used CRISPR-Cas, which we've incorporated into the virus. So now if this virus can do gene editing in an intact animal or person and can knock in a corrective gene so it expresses long term. So in essence, we've taken this useful vector, adenovirus, many useful properties. We can grow it to high titer so it's compatible with pharmacologic implementation. It's targetable so it can deliver to selective cells and now we've given it this missing capacity. By using CRISPR-Cas, we can engineer the knock-in precisely where we want in the host DNA at sites we call safe harbors, places where we know we can put in new genes without any safety problems. We believe that by combining the useful attributes of adenovirus with the useful capacities of CRISPR-Cas, we now have a vector that can accomplish all of these pharmacologic goals.